everyone. Today I'm gonna to talk about how to take your workouts to the next level. First, you gotta make sure your nutrition is on point. You can have a cheat meal or two every week, but don't make it a daily thing. Nutrition is the most important thing you can do to change the way you look and feel. This, more than anything, will decide how far you go. The better you eat, the better you'll look and the stronger you'll get. Number two, track your calories. This will help guarantee if you're eating the calories needed to gain muscle or lose weight. You might think you know how many calories you're consuming, but you'd be surprised how off you are when you start tracking. Number three, drink lots of water. Need to stay hydrated and replace what you lose when you sweat to keep your system running smoothly. Number four, get your rest. You need to get at least seven hours of sleep to recover properly. It's going to be real hard to get a good workout in if you're really sleepy or tired. So rest is essential for you to be at your best. Number five, get your blood work done. This is important to see if you're deficient in anything. Also, check to see if you're allergic to any foods. Another thing to do is get your alkaline pH test done. Testing your body's pH will give you a sense of whether your body is trending toward metabolic acidity or is in the balanced slight alkaline state that's necessary for healthy bones. Number six, avoid alcohol if you can. That's a lot of extra calories you don't need and it takes away from nutrient rich calories. Alcohol has shown that it interferes with your body's production of human growth hormone, which is an essential part of helping muscle repair and grow. Number seven, stick to your goal for at least six months. If your goal is to lose weight, then give it a chance to see it through. Don't switch to bulking after a month or two. Number eight, lagging body parts. If you have a lagging body part, then work that body part more often. If you're working it once a week, then make it two. If it's two a week, then make it three. If you're already working it out three times a week, then maybe do less sets per session. Number nine, strength, gain muscle, or endurance. Do you wanna get stronger? Do you wanna gain muscle? or do you want endurance? If you want strength, you want to do one to five reps, 80 to 90% of a one rep max, and take three to five minute rest between sets. If you want to gain muscle, you want to do six to 12 reps, 60 to 80% of your one rep max, and take a one to three minute rest. For endurance, you want to do 13 to 20 plus reps, 40 to 60% of your one rep max and 30 to 45 second rest. Number 10, log your workouts. Hard to see if you're improving or not if you don't keep track. Also keep track of how you feel that day or if you took longer than usual rest between sets. Number 11, stick to a routine. If you're a beginner, stick to the same routine for at least six months. If you're an intermediate, stick to it for at least three months and if you're advanced, at least one month. If you're constantly changing your workouts, it's hard to see if you're improving or getting stronger. Number 12, keep strict form and full motion on all your exercises. Doing this will help you get stronger faster. If you're doing half reps or doing it wrong, your muscles won't grow and you'll eventually get hurt. Number 13, back off of heavy weight for a week or so. If you're doing constant heavy lifting, your body will adapt to it and you will also put too much wear and tear on your muscles and this could lead to your injury. Number 14, don't forget the basics. You need to do compound movements. Cables and machines are good, but you have to start with barbells and dumbbells. Exercises like squats, deadlifts, presses, and rows are very important when wanting to gain muscle. Number 15, unilateral exercises. Make sure to include a single limb exercise for each body part. For example, lunges, one-arm preacher curls, dumbbell rows, side cable or dumbbell lateral with one arm, hammer rows. And last one, number 16, ancillary exercises. If you're trying to improve your bench, you want to do incline dumbbells, dips, and overhead presses to strengthen your shoulders and tricep work like skull crushers to work your triceps. So that's it. Hopefully now you know how to take your workouts to the next level. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell so you know when the next video is coming out. Also, please share with your friends. I'm Ray Vasquez. Thank you for watching.